good Josh, your boy Ross back at it again with another video. So I wanted to kind of talk to you guys, man. Uh, I wanted to do something different uh, for this video. Um, I know you guys love the wrestling content, but sometimes I like to sprinkle in some gems, you know, every now and then or some type of advice for some of you guys that may be going through a particular situation. And in this video, I want to talk about people taking advantage of your financial success and your financial gain there are people out there that really only care about how much money you make and what you can do for them you know and you gotta be aware of that and the funny thing about these individuals they're very very slick on how they approach you 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 may not even be able to tell that they're really just wanting the money or or really like that you're financially uh, i guess you can say in a real good position and there's nothing wrong with uh, a man and a woman wanting their significant other or their partner to be in a, a good financial state but you wouldn't really sometimes be able to tell that those individuals only really like to be around you when the money's good when you're doing good financially and you gotta be careful about that and they can sit up there and you know pretend like you know that they're not there for the money or they'll they'll disguise it because maybe the individual has their own money and they're paying for their stuff and all this other stuff but then when you are going through a hard time or going through a rough patch they don't have that same energy they start to look at you differently they start to treat you differently they start to look down upon you because you don't have it like you used to have it and that is why especially in today's climate you have to be very careful and very discerning of who you hang around with and who you get involved with because a lot of people uh, nowadays uh, tend to really focus on the looks and the money and then the personality and, uh, you know, vibes, they come later. But it's really those two things. And people will say, oh, no, I'm into someone's personality more than what's in their pocketbook. You sure about that? You got to ask yourself this type of question. If your significant other started hitting a rough patch, because that's what life is sometimes about. Life is, has its ups and life has its lows. You know what I'm saying? So if your significant other is going through a, a tough time financially maybe they lost their job maybe they got laid off or maybe they had to take care of some unforeseen bills that's what life is all about would you still have that person's back would you still hold them down until they're able to bounce back would you still be there or would you look down upon them would you sit up there and and not you know help them out when they need it that is what I'm really trying to convey to people to really watch out for it. And hell, I got to watch out myself. You know what I'm saying? I have to be discerning myself on who I allow in my life and why they're in my life. And I wanted to bring this video to you guys because maybe somebody right now that's watching this video is going through that very same situation. Maybe they were in a relationship or got into a relationship with someone and they was doing good you know they was you know making good money life was going good for them everything was falling into place and then something happened and now that other person is not looking at them the same now they they're coming at them differently they don't have that same type of passion or love anymore because you're not making as much money as you was if you're going through that right now man i will say this to you remove yourself from that situation Remove yourself from that situation as soon as possible. Don't be involved in stuff like that. Pay attention to signs like that. Because best believe when you get yourself out of that rut, when you start elevating yourself to the to the level you was before things went rough, and well, things went bad, or you even elevate yourself past the level that you didn't even think you could do, best believe those same people that said they had your back then disappeared all of a sudden they will come back around oh man i knew you could get yourself out of it i knew you could figure it out pay attention to those people bro please pay attention to those 
to those signs to those individuals man and i'm honest i'm also put this out there yes being in a a, a relationship does require some financial stability and that's why you know sometimes you have to hold off on a relationship with anybody with anyone until you get yourself financially good and i understand that but at the same time money and looks cannot be the number one and number two things that hold you down in a relationship because that's not always sometimes going to be there the looks sometimes may not be the same when you're 50 60 years old you know it's not going to be the same the money may not even be the same too you never know because life happens so you got to always have something that really holds that relationship together and the best thing that can hold a relationship together even a, a friendship too is the person the genuine person behind the looks behind the money how are they their personality their thought process their their motivations you know you know those things matter because those are tied to you money's not tied to you your looks yes it's physically tied to you but that's just surface level and i and i wanted to put this out there because I, I really want to promote people you know making sure that hey if you got your money good now protect your money and protect yourself from these individuals that say you know you know they got you you know that support you that you know oh i'm you know what i'm saying I'm, I'm, I'm loving what you're doing i love you loving your hunger and drive and then something happens and now all of a sudden they you know they're not even trying to mess with you no more be very cautious of those individuals man and i i, I hope someone takes a lesson from this video to be able to understand you know everyone has their highs and lows like i said in this video everyone has their season and when your season comes up for you to you know glow up elevate and, and prosper there's gonna be people that come around that's gonna you know pretend that you know they they will always have your back but when something goes wrong they disappear man so comment down below let me know have you guys ever been in a relationship or a friendship where when everything was going good financially you had the money you was good you know everything was straight but then all of a sudden something came up you didn't have the funds or you wasn't making as much money before or maybe you lost your job or whatever the situation was and they switched up have you ever been in that situation before I would love to get your guys thoughts and opinions on that man and just like i said videos like this that i drop on my page every now and then i enjoy doing them because it comes from the heart and i, I just really want to be able to help people that are going through some of the situations i've been through some of the situations i've seen some of my close friends go through and try to guide you guys and help you guys out so you guys are not going through the same thing or you'll be at least aware of what's going on you like, oh okay let me handle this like this because I know how this is going to play out. So appreciate all the love and support. Road to 50K. Appreciate y'all kicking it with me. And I'll see y'all on the next one. Peace.